Story at 11, the Peach County Health Department is getting a new home. Well, at least for the time being. Our Kayla Solomon checked out the temporary spot and tells us about the new renovations in store. Across from the Bluebird Bus Company sits an empty doctor's office that will have a new tenant within the next few weeks. County commissioners uh, approached me and asked if I'd be interested in leasing the building. And I said uh, yes, because uh, to have somebody in the building is better than having an empty building. Dr. George Shoup built this building himself in 1988. It was his family practice up until his retirement in 2005. Well, I had a very large practice here. Uh, I suspect, well, I know the largest in the Fort Valley. His new tenants, the Peach County Department of Health, at least for the next year. They have to leave their current building for renovations, and so they've, uh, We've agreed to lease this building to them. Leaking roof, outdated waiting rooms, and exam rooms, these are just a few of the items the Peach County Commission voted to fix and improve at the old health department. Uh, we're also looking to incorporate a telemedicine room to expand our services, as well as an enlarged WIC area for our WIC clients. These renovations will cost over $860,000 with $100,000 coming from the county and the rest coming from a community block development grant from the Georgia Department of Community Affairs. We want clients to feel safe and that they're in a um, updated medical facility that they're going to receive expert care in and of course we want our staff to be proud of their actual environment that they're giving their services. In. They hope to complete these renovations in nine months to a year. In Fort Valley, Kayla Solomon, 13 WMAZ News. Hawkinson says the move to the new building begins August 19th and services will begin on August 22nd.